Shusher is a double entendre. At once, Lewis Carroll's infamous cat and the grin of blackface minstrelsy. The film aims to highlight contemporary art through a black cultural lens. It was produced by Jocelyn Cooper of Afropunk, a cultural movement that strives to bring together different cultures and opinions. I think that there is an African American voice and there are there is a culture and experiences that come through in the art and that's what our goal was to highlight that and and our culture. Right, it yeah. it was to talk about folks that may not or tell the stories of artists that may not necessarily uh, that are part of the contemporary la landscape but whose stories through a cultural lens are not always uh, talked about. There's just art. Then people break it up into categories that make them feel more, more comfortable with the world. People tend to like to categorize, but really there's just art and there's just individuals. I mean, all the race and all that stuff comes in afterwards. The film also explores the works of Biggers, known for his dramatic works fusing film, video, installation, sculpture, drawing, original music, and performance. You cannot imagine what it would be like for her to smile. Kenyan born Mutu is an international multimedia artist and sculptor, best known for her fantastical collages melding the female form with the machine, animal, and the unexpected, and is all about making art more accessible. Celestine Caroné. CCTV.